Hi, this is Paul from globaltradingsoftware.com and this is a video for all of those rookie novice investors out there in stocks. All this pullback that we're seeing right now, nobody sees opportunity uh, in the markets, everybody's staying out, but people are still making investments, mainly institutional traders and those retail investors that uh, understand the behavior. So this there's ways to invest when there's misery in the world. So whether it's a, in this case, I'm going to be looking at hurricanes, uh, what we call hurricane stocks, and what, and also war, where we, you know, the Ukraine is at war at the moment, but lots of governments are supporting them by buying arms, uh, and there's certain stocks that will actually do well during those periods of time where others pull back so i'm not going to really do any technical analysis today i'm just going to show you some behaviors because investing is all about understanding behaviors so this is just a, a candlestick chart and every single candle that you see on this chart is a whole week in time so when we look out and I'm, when i'm going back to the last two major hurricanes for example and home depot in the usa and those people not in the usa don't be afraid uh, that you know to invest in those uh, usa based stocks because they do move uh, probably a lot better than FTSE or european stocks so two major hurricanes in the last few years 2018 september october 2018 and then again uh, in 2020. So uh, what happens here is that hurricane happens, lots of damage is done, and then people uh, need to claim off their insurance uh, and then uh, start buying all the, all the bits and bobs to, uh, to, you know, to repair their houses or rebuild their houses and that sort of thing. So stocks like Home Depot, Costco, that sort of thing, really do well after the misery okay so you see here where up on the first h we get this initial dip uh insurance claims start to come through people start to spend money and the stock price goes up the same here 2020 we get the hurricane we get a slight dip insurance claims come through people start spending money profits start to go high for the company and there so it's understanding that behavior costco is exactly the same pattern of behavior same two hurricanes little pullbacks big moves little pullback big moves up so again investors can if they understand uh, these particular instances that happen in the world mainly around misery um, you know uh, there are stocks that do well uh, right now uh, there is a conflict C for conflict in Ukraine and we started you know this started you know beginning of 2022 uh, but lots of governments in the way they're supporting this particular uh, conflict in the ukraine is to actually buy arms of people like lockheed martin okay uh, and and other uh, arms dealers if you like uh, people that make cruise missiles and other types of missiles anti-tank weapons that sort of thing their profits will go up so investors will start to take some money out of microsoft for example because it's not going anywhere at the moment and the you know um, most of the stocks are coming down but this stock had a big boost because of those sales and then there's those safer stocks when we look at visa and mastercard so other stocks right now this year in the first six months of this year have pulled back considerably so they've gone down consider considerably but when you look at visa and you look at mastercard although they've come down they've stabilized and hold because as soon as economies start to pick up again people will, will start to spend on credit and they will start making more money and these stocks prices will go up so for example you know we're, we're not just making um, money out of misery with uh, hurricane stocks or uh, you know defense stocks there are stocks out there especially fin big financial stocks like visa and mastercard that will weather these types of storms pretty well on and are good value right now because when people start spending money again and they'll spend it on credit these companies will make more money 
hopefully that helps it's just a quick video to say that there's there's a lot of despair out there but if you look carefully and understand the behavior in the markets and understand what institutional traders are doing you 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 can make some good investment choices right now instead of sitting uh, on your hands hopefully that helps speak to you all really soon